A famous explorer once said that the extraordinary is in what we do, not who we are. I'd finally set out to make my mark, to find adventure. But instead, adventure found me. moments when life flashes before us we find something something that keeps us going something that pushes us
Is anyone listening? Please respond. Thank you. 
Here's the soon-to-be world-famous archaeologist, Lara Croft, in her native habitat. She's on the hunt for the lost kingdom of Yamatai, home to the fabulous Himiko, mythical sun queen, and ancestor of yours truly. <laughs> Sam, this is serious. Oh, sweetie, I know. I'm just trying to lighten the mood here. Everyone's so on edge. What are you so worried about? I'm close to something. I'm sure of it. I just don't know if the others will listen. Or even if they should. Lara, you know this stuff better than anyone. Seriously, I'm not just saying this to make you feel better. I trust you, Roth trusts you. You got this. Now let's take a break, okay? Okay, okay. And Sam, thanks. She's not always this serious, you know? How can you suggest I'm not serious about this expedition, Laura? It's not just Sam's family funding us. I put my savings on the line, too. We've all got some kind of stake in this. The funding won't last forever, Whitman. That's precisely why we should push east, not west. No one believes Yamatai... No one believes Yamatai is that far east. The books simply don't support it. Well, whoever wrote those books never found Yamatai. I've talked to Roth about this. There's no point in following in other people's footsteps, Dr. Whitman. I refuse to bet my reputation on your hunch. I'm the lead archaeologist here. And when were you last in the field with a TV crew behind you? Got 30 years experience, two PhDs, one in East Asian history. So why don't you just stick to boats, Mr. Grimm? Ship, Dr. Whitman. It's a ship. You don't need a PhD to know that. Going east will take us directly into the Dragon's Triangle. That's where we need to go. Lara, my little bird. I'd follow you almost anywhere, but that place is a bad energy. Bad storms, more like. Makes the Bermuda Triangle look like Disney World. <laughs> Sign me up. The stories about Queen Himiko say she could summon storms. Myths are usually based on some version of the truth. What if Yamatai was somewhere in the Triangle itself? Well, look, this is the satellite imagery from inside the Dragon's Triangle. That doesn't look good. If it's wet, I can sail on it. Oh, don't tell me you're seriously cons... Reyes is right. We don't have the funds to piss about. It's now or never. Lara's offering fresh ideas and a plan. I'm the captain here. It's my decision. We're going into the Dragon's Triangle. Why am I even here? Find something to eat. Oh, God. What's going on here? Wait, I can use that bow. things still works. Just remember Roth's training. You can have the best form and technique in the world, but it won't mean a thing if you can't focus. The key to using any weapon is focus. So hungry. I need to find something to eat.
sorry. You won't always have some fancy gadget to tell you where you are. If you can learn to read the land and the stars, you'll always be able to find your way home. This is Conrad Roth, Captain of the Endurance. We are shipwrecked on an island inside the Dragon's Triangle. Roth! Lara! You're alive! Easy, easy. Are you okay? What happened? I remember the beach, and then it went black, and I woke up in a cave. There was this crazy man, Roth, and a dead body. Oh, God. Where are you now, Lara? Are you safe? It was so horrible. It's all my fault. This is all my fault. Lara, listen to me. I sent an SOS from the Endurance before I abandoned her. Hopefully someone caught it. I've spoken to the others. We're regrouping at my location. Please come and get me. I have to stay here. You can do this, Lara. Remember when we climbed Snowden? You said the key was knowing that all you've got to do is just keep, keep moving. moving. Remember everything I've taught you, Lara. You're ready for this. And keep your radio on. Okay.
Hello? Hello? Is someone there? This could be a way through. Damn it! What are these markings? represents a hateful woman in the guise of a demon. There are traces of white paint on the inside. Whoever used this mask was of noble birth. Did you get that? Got it. We have a fire. Look for the smoke. We're on our way. Laura, you made it. Sam. Um, Thank goodness. Surprise. It's okay. He's one of us. Sorry if I startled you. This place would make anyone a little jumpy. We just spoke to your crew. They're on their way. Look, he bandaged my foot. <laughs> oh, it was the least I could do. My manners. I'm sorry, I'm Matthias. A teacher by trade. Not really cut out for island life, I'm afraid. <laughs> Sweetie, you look exhausted. Sit down. Yeah. Sam here was just telling me about the sun queen. Right, Himiko. Can you tell me more? I'm intrigued. 
Well, believe it or not, a couple thousand years ago, Queen Himiko pretty much ran things in Japan. <laughs> she loves telling this story. Himiko was beautiful, enigmatic, but also ruthless and powerful. Legend says she had shamanistic powers. And this is where she loses me. Well, there's always some truth to myths. She commanded an army of samurai warriors, her magnificent storm guard. They rode the very winds of the battle, laying waste to all who opposed them. They say the sun rose at Himiko's command, and she ruled everything its rays touched, from the mountains to the sea and beyond. <sighs> but what happened to you? She was with you. She was here with that man, Matthias. But I passed out. When I woke up, they were both gone. You can't shoot Nico one time off. We need to find them. No, uh, wait, wait, wait. What about Raw? Okay, let's split up. One of us go with Lara and meet up with Raw. The rest of us should fan out and look for Sam. I'll go with her. No, no. Le uh, let me. You know how to use one of these? It's it's been a while. It's all coming back to me. Get to Roth. We'll find Sam and this Matthias guy. You, you gonna be okay? Yes, I... Oh, we just need to rest for a few minutes. You sit, uh... You sit here. I'll, uh... <clears throat> I'll check up ahead. Okay. Not so bad.
could have warned me about the wolves, Doctor. These are fascinating. I've seen these before. Oh? They must be ritualistic. This, this female image is particularly interesting. Looks like it was made quite recently. It's by those islanders, no doubt. Judging by the wrecks out there, they were once like us. Survivors. <laughs> Remarkable. Yes, well, let's hope we don't become murderers, too. See if you can work the other one. Handle's missing. Together. Oh, shit. It won't take the force. I'll have to find something sturdier to turn it with. Must be something around here we can use. Incredible. This'll work. Just need a bit more. Back up! Right, that should do it. Let's see if I can fix this axe. Lara Croft, an archaeologist from the Endurance, shipwrecked on an island in the Dragon's Triangle, east of Japan. This place is incredible. I've seen wrecks here that could date back centuries. We weren't the first, and I know we're not alone. Something isn't right about this place. If I don't get off this island, maybe someone will eventually find this. Give it a go, then. Let's do this, Doctor. Whenever you're ready. <sighs> that female figure on the gate. Given the age of the symbols, it could be the Sun Queen. Himiko. Are you sure you're not channeling Sam, Dr. Whitman? Well, there's no doubt. Himiko had power. Some say shamanistic, elemental. A woman wields that much power, and sooner or later it gets called witchcraft. We shouldn't discount anything, even what may seem to us irrational. We still have much to learn about the world. You sound like my father. It could be one hell of a story, Laura. Not if we don't live to tell it. Incredible. Oh, it is Himiko. But look, the bowl, the candles. Why is she still being worshipped? This island, it must have once been part of Yamatai. You were right, Lara. The Lost Kingdom. 
It's like finding Atlantis. But this is real, Dr. Whitman. We're not standing on a myth. No, <laughs> we're standing on a gold mine. Come, quickly. Your friends are hurt. Yes, probably by them. Get back. They can't be trusted. <gasps> you still have a gun. I don't want any trouble. No. We'll come. No. But I insist that afterwards you take us to whoever's in charge. What are you doing? Be quiet. No! I'm handling this! No! No! Oh! no! Please! Get off! Just, just go along with them, Laura. Do, do whatever they say. Dai minha pistolet. Who are you people? What do you with us? Laura! If they give you any trouble, kill them! Don't hurt them, please! I said, silence, girl. A ti viet, harosinka yada, napominayash mayu siestru. Let go! Let go! Laura, run! No! Oh no! No! Round them up! Run them up! Don't you fucking move! Kill them all! Hey, bring Don't up the prisoner! Yeah, I'm on it! Let's see, I need a study. I'm not a reporter! Ruby! Get down! Now! Here! Anything? Keep looking! There! Another one! Oh, God! Hey! Hey! They got a runner in the trap! This group is such a fight. They're gonna have to kill me. Too bad. Do some reports. All right! What do you see? Nothing. No, 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 Вылезай! Но трать моего времени! Она тоже была порадочной стерва!
So what came in? Another tanker? Nah. Looked like some kind of research. What was that? Stay here. I'll check it out. What the hell? What's going on down there? Everything okay? Lada, are you there? Yes. I can see smoke coming from the old ruins. Are you okay? Oh God, Roth, I'm in trouble. They're killing people. What? Who? Men. I don't know why. I had to kill some of them. I had no choice. That can't have been easy. It's scary just how easy it was. You've got to warn the others, Roth. Don't worry about them right now. You just do whatever it takes to get to me, Lana. I'll try. about nightmares is sooner or later you wake up but there's no waking up from this place which means I'm really here I'm really doing these things no don't think about it Lara not now it won't help I don't know what's happened to the rest of the crew I hope they're okay they have to be they have to be I don't know what the hell is going on here all that matters is that Roth finds a way to get us home. Days have passed since the plane crash. For a second time, we attempted to escape by boat with disastrous results. I knew it would happen, just like the first time. The calm sea turned hostile with no explanation. The moment we made for open water, the winds picked up, followed by an impossible wave. Like a child's toy, our lifeboat was smashed violently into the rocky shore. Now, two more lie dead, and another is wounded beyond help. The others are starting to panic, and they're looking to me for a plan. I do have one, but it doesn't include them. They are weak and stupid, a liability in this place. I suggested they make another attempt to leave, but I won't join them. To do so would be suicide. This is clear to me now.
got word from the West Beach. Looks like a smaller group escaped into the lower forest. Maybe we get a hunting party down there. No. You hear that? I'll take a look. Somewhere. Find her. Capture or kill? Kill her! What was that? Quiet! Quiet! You two, check that side!
wind pounded us for days. We couldn't build shelter or forage for food. Christ, we couldn't even move. It was like some enormous hand was holding us down. Just as the storm was finally breaking, Father Matthias came to us. He was calm and soft-spoken. He seemed to know us, our names, where we were from. He spoke to us in our native language, and we listened. And as we listened, he told us the truth of this island. He offered us a choice, salvation or death. Some chose to defy him. And without hesitation, he killed them then and there. Father Matthias didn't seem malicious or angry, just calm and decisive. As I stood there in the sand, wet with the blood of my comrades, I knew I could never refuse him. by a villager or a noble, maybe. Used by samurai to relay orders to their soldiers in battle. Pretty solid. Must be made of stained cypress. 